Mesozoic era was millions of years ago, with varieties of reptiles calling the Earth home. Triassic, Jurassic, and Cretaceous, three geological times will convey What's this. What's a species that can run, fly, and be scaly? Jump and even roar and do these things daily. Some are long short, but all start as babies. There are some dino dudes and some dino ladies. Let's take it back to a land before time, where reptiles were big, small, or medium sized. They loved to roll in packs or even fly. Some were so majestic, but some would horrify. Brontosauruses were long from head to tail. Ankylosauruses were spiny, short with hard shells. Velociraptors ran at these speeds or more. Iguanodons walked on two legs or four. Some had sharp teeth for tearing meat. Some ground their food with wide flat teeth. The Brachiosauruses were tall and ate a bunch up high. Microraptors looked low for their food supply. We wanted to name a few, so we made a list. And it goes like this. Apotosaurus. Diplodocus. Iguanodon and the Lambiosaurus Velociraptor Stegosaurus the Microraptor and the Tyrannosaurus Rex Their large bodies needed a lot of food There are three major types that we will include Stegosauruses like their meals to be green As herbivores they love to munch on leaves The omnivores were not picky at all Fruit seeds and animals that were small The Tyrannosaurus Rex which was the most vicious They're carnivorous meaning animals were delicious Dinosaur babies were hatched from eggs Hatchlings had wings and some had legs Dinosaur families found safety in numbers Whether they were awake or as they slumbered They traveled in packs or even roamed alone That's why the unearthing of fossils and what bones have shown these ancient lizards are a thing of the past A special kind of scientist was able to trace their paths A paleontologist studies the fossils and bones To determine if their feet had claws or toes Robert Plot found the first dino bone He thought it was from a human and he hadn't known It's interesting to study these reptile giants It's important to our history and also to science These creatures were incredibly unique Their habitat was destroyed and now they're extinct 